Hi everyone, this is Fozio from Fozio Creations. Today I'll be doing a chain pull, a ball chain pull using this. This is a two millimeter, and this is I think a 1.5. And maybe, just maybe, I'll be using these Mardi Gras or Christmas tree decoration. Whatever they are called. <laughs> yeah. And here's an example of what I will be doing. Either this. I'm still not decided. I don't know where I'm going with this. Just going with the flow. Like I usually do. Or oh, something similar to this. So I think I want something like this. Because this is a 40 by 50. I think, yeah, 40 by 50 canvas, or is it 16 by 20? I think so, inch. But yeah, here we go. Wish me luck. Let me show you how I am mix. Okay, I use glitter to mix with this um, color shift pigment. It's a mica pigment powder got it off aliexpress yeah budget friendly <laughs> so i mix it with this glitter this fluid glitter this is the brand i use and let me just show you quickly how i do it this is not the color i'll be using this is a purple blue green purple let's see if you can can you i don't know Purple, blue, green. Here we go. I have very little left in here. Oh, come on. Okay. I'm just gonna, this is just to sh give you an idea how I mix it. And then just take very little these come in little jars but you can get more if you want i just wanted to try it try them out so i bought the little jars and literally that much <laughs> i even probably need less but for this amount of glitter i need that much mica and then, oops. And then, mix, mix, mix. Keep mixing until it's all incorporated. <laughs> if you are going to try it. And it's almost ready. But right now it has so many bubbles. So I wouldn't recommend using it at the moment. And I add water to it. Where's my water? I add very little water to it. Like a few drops. Two, three. Because this is a very little amount of glitter. So... Are still thick you can still use it thick if you want but yeah I think it's a waste <laughs> so that should be good just like a pour almost see that consistent is dropping from the stick it's not how do I say this plumping <laughs> i don't know how to say that oh yeah anyway that's good you could even make it thinner if you want really but i wouldn't recommend too thin thin okay done let's get this out of the way and i'll be back with the base the black base and we'll begin oh i forgot I have warm water and soap to wash the ball chains 
This is for rinsing off. And paper towels to dry. Or cloth or rug, whatever you want. This is so easy. And yeah, I'll be back. See you. Hey, I'm back. I changed the angle a bit to bring it closer, but my lighting is so bad. So this is the best I can do. So I decided to go with blue, green, gold. I'm not sure how this is going to turn out, but here we go. Okay. I put some in. Actually, I'll leave. This is what I'm going to do. I'll be dipping the bowl chain right in there. Swirl it around. And then wipe off excess. And that's about it. And then place it on the canvas where you want it to go. So I'm just going to start. I, I don't know how this is going to turn out, but here we go. Okay. Here we go. Put it in the warm water. I'm going to put this right here. Oh, guys, can you see that? I hope you can. Another one. Place it right in here. Oops. This excess. So I will place it down and make like a. See that? Um, I don't know what kind of shape, what kind of shape is that? <laughs> put this in here, I'm gonna put this here. So I'm thinking of going like this. Just fan it out that way. So I'll try to explain this again. So I lay down the chain in a wavy pattern to form like a leaf shape when you pull. I will then pull towards the right. And then slowly start pulling towards the left. And that will create the leaf pattern or shape. So I basically keep repeating layering one on top of the other until I'm happy with the design. And I used mostly the two millimeter ball chains and mm, I think three times I pulled with the 1.5. I didn't like uh, the effect with that one because I could not see the glitter or the color shift. So the bigger the, cha the ball chain, the better <laughs> so yeah I just keep repeating go with the flow it doesn't have to be perfect I just was having fun I loved doing this seeing how the color shifts the layering it looks really beautiful I did resin it and I'm still going to do one more and it's super stunning I will post the finished result on my Instagram page and hopefully in the groups as well. But yeah, I wanted to post this video as soon as I could. I've been busy, but I hope this helps those who are, who are trying to try this technique out and were 
having a hard time with it. I hope this helps. And yeah, enjoy the video and the music I'm about to play. And if you have any questions, please feel free to ask. And yeah, hope you like, share, subscribe if you haven't. And see you soon. I'll be dropping another video like this one soon. This time it's a red... No, it's a purple, blue... Hmm, purple, blue, green?